Kotoko were aiming to come back to winning ways after losing to Karela and Hartsobok in two successive defeats. The player at the Cape Coast Sports Stadium, their home game, the first home game for them in Cape Coast for television coverage purposes, up against Bechem United, who came back to draw 3 3 with Elmina Sharks after going down 3 3. So, Jim Fee asked early questions, and Jordan could have scored the first goal with his early chance. Goalkeeper Prince Asempa was completely beaten, but Jordan did not make it count. Eric Owusu got this cross in, and Agbesima's header was saved by rewarded with the best player award. And Wahab did want to get his header away from Owusu's free kick. Good defensive play from Wahab. That was pretty close. First half ended goalless, and Bechem came into the second half more purposeful and eager to break the deadlock. Hafiz Konkoni got a powerful shot and Felix Annan saved it for Asante Kotoko. Jane Fee got this left-footed cross in, but Frederick Barton's header saved by Asempa. The header was not powerful enough. Header by Frederick Barton, saved by Asempa. So again, Felix Annan was out with his brave save up against the striker. Not all goalkeepers would go in for this challenge, but he was brave enough to have prevented Hafiz from scoring. And this is Asante Kotoko's moment of glory. Esiam Abadu got the ball onto the part of Jemfi, and hey, he slots it without any difficulties. 1-0 for Asante Kotoko, Emmanuel Jemfi. And again, Dan Ajin with his opportunity to equalize, he didn't make it count. Asante Kotoko, back in winning ways, Good football, Asante Kotoko, after 90 minutes, up by one goal against Bechem United.